Oi, oi, lads. I'm gonna play some Simic artifacts. Someone said that some, uh, there's there's somebody popping off top 10 in the ladder with Simic artifacts. You you show me a guy who's top 10 in standard and I will I will try their deck, no problemo. Alright, I've heard I've heard talk on the grapevine about cookie cutter. Wormlet. Siren. Blue green artifact aggro. Do we we must have some other ones, right? I mean, there's quite a lot of good choices, huh? No removal, just smart. We've got Larcenist. And our, our small number of re removal spells would be... That's another kind of justification for Audacity, right? Alright, so all I want to do is cast my cards and the opponent dies. Let's see if that happens. Spoiler, it might not happen. It might not happen, man. It might not happen. You love this deck? You made this exact deck last night? It looks fun, dude. And I've heard of at least two different people that are doing well with it, so... <clears throat> Let's give it a go, man. Let's give it a go. <laughs> I think we've made some pretty reasonable choices here with our card selections. Cyborg is nice too, man. Cyborg is very nice. Maybe maybe we should have all four mates. Probably, probably maybe be one Pierce and four mates. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 4th run portal. I mean, that's, you, that's what you gotta do, man. What you gotta do if you want to play these two color decks without fast lands. You need 4th run portal and you need cards in your deck that say I gain a lot of life. We have both. So if, for, if you want to play aggro, at least. Or, or be a tribe, yeah. Be a tribe is fine too. Esper, huh? Esper, Esper, Esper. I guess against the Esper, I'll just try and pump up my Siren. <clears throat> Alright, good lands here. Any Larcenists, please? <laughs> right, actually, we don't want a Larcenist. We want the the Glyph. Give me the Glyph. Okay. Good hand. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There's a spell on top for sure. <laughs> Still not sure if they're actually, if they're playing Esper Legends or Esper Midrange. They're playing the bat. <laughs> I mean, I respect the bat, but I'm not happy about them seeing my hand. <clears throat> I do respect the bat though. Great card. I think a trade would be good for us. If 
five, six, seven, eight, 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 eight. They've got they've got bat and the boat too. What the hell? What have they cut? St they've still got virtue. Bat can crew. I mean, the, the the bat and the boat are both good. So I'm not I'm not doubting adding those to the deck. I'm wondering what the, I I can't work out what they've cut though, because they still seem to have every other card that would be in the deck too. Three, five, eight, ten. A little too late, yes, a little too late. I guess if you're playing the bat, you can, they've probably cut the counters, uh, make disappears, and then uh, I guess you can play a little bit less removal if you have the bat. Keep watch for intruders. Looks good though. How we greet our enemies. Yeah, the tough, the tough cookie. The, the problem with the cookie is it's just it's really bad unless the game is like very grindy, right? No, it is. Uh, don't get me wrong. This is standard, man. A lot of games are grindy as hell, but. <clears throat> You play against someone who's curving out and your cookie starts to look a little, little sussy backer. <laughs> I mean, I guess I have to block, don't I? Not got much choice. Hopefully they didn't keep a land in their hand, because they did see my beset you. They kept it. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I think we might be dead, chat. That was a lot of lands, to be fair, but... Esper, 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 huh? Yeah, opponent is definitely sensible. I mean, Esper is... Esper would just completely die as a deck if I had to keep playing Mate Disappear, but changing it for the bat is, is, uh, does make a hella sense, man. Hella, hella sense. Chat, 
Jinj, Pierce, 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 Pierce. Oh, Pierce is worse now, actually, against them. With the bat. Definitely worse. <clears throat> Dude, our main deck is honestly good. We don't need to change too much. We just need to uh, maybe change our ratio of lands to spells in our hand. The Larsonist we can make use of, though. Try this. Actually, yeah, let me cut a, cut a cookie. Copium, I mean, I don't I don't know if this deck is going to be good, but it, it, it should be good against Esper, though. Wormlet Bolt <clears throat> Yeah, this will be much harder for them to withstand, right? We need to try and get a counter on the boat somehow though If possible So that it can attack into a Rafine, right? Why Thran in two colours? You need it in two colours, man. Uh, like, if you're for an aggro deck, anyway. If you've got a lot of one drops, you need it. Or in some of the two colour decks, I mean. The ones that don't have the fast lands. You need to either. You can you need to play Thran Portal if you want to play the creature lands, right? Which we of course we do. <laughs> yeah, a way to get an early counter on the boat would make a big difference against the uh, Rafine decks. That that's a good card, but it doesn't it doesn't work on the boat though. Bing, bing. I mean it does, but not really. It will drop off at the end of the turn, right? <laughs> Cauldron, yes, but you can't really get a... How do you get a card into your graveyard? For Cauldron. Fellow Boat Enjoyer spotted. Explore? Yeah, I mean, we've got map tokens. I, like, I, want, I do want the map. But I mean, if you've got the map token, though, you can just put the counter. You can put the count, the plus one plus one counter on the boat, right? You don't need. You don't need cauldron at that point. Wormlet is very strong uh, before you've played all your artifacts, not so much after. They have Mastermind too. Yeah, I've, I think I think they've cut the they've cut the make disappears. They must have. There's, there's nothing else to cut. Mm -hmm. 
So gin I've got some Sir Ginger sideboards. So Ginger does not seem like a main deck card to me. Lethal, huh? Two off. We have. <clears throat> They're kind of two off as well. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I think they can kill us here, but it's quite unlikely. And then uh, we should be able to win. With Ottawara and Audacity next turn. Because <clears throat> they, they can only gain a maximum of five here, right? Up to nine, we've already got at least nine anyway. But they do have make this appear too. What the hell, man? <clears throat> what the actual hell? Bat, the bat is nice, man. The bat is nice. There's no, there's no hiding from the facts. Ottawa is cheat. <laughs> We weren't too fast in either of those games, were we? We had the Ginger Brute. The second one was definitely better, but Ginger Brute into Bolt. What did I, what did I do in turn three? Ginger Brute Bolt. I think they just cut the number of... They probably just trimmed everything, basically, to get the Bolt and the Bat in. Because we, we saw Go for the Throat. We saw Make This Appear. We saw every card that's in that deck. Normally. So I mean, the only the only answer is that they uh, they trimmed a few cards, right? <laughs> I mean, they should they should have cut make disappear. Um, what am I trying to say here? 
Yes, make, make this appear they should cut the most copies of because of the caverns, right? But replacing it with bolt and bat sounds very reasonable. Square over that. That wasn't Esper Legends, though. That was just like the normal Esper uh, wedding announcement deck. The rats, too. The rats or whatever. Yeah, they can go. Virtues. Yeah, they're all random cards. There, there is a lot more Esper than I thought there would be, man. But I guess I, I thought Esper was going to be unplayable because Make Disappear is unplayable, but yeah, I didn't really consider that you could just take out Make Disappear and play Bat. That, that, that will definitely keep Esper alive, man. <laughs> there is no doubt. make this appear as playable is it's not man uh, I've clicked on the wrong artifact whoops <laughs> okay yes Minor mistake there. It's only it's only four damage, chat. Four damage in your aggro pick. <clears throat> this is fine. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> four damage and three mana, I guess. <laughs> okay, that was a I made a, a gameplay error there. Actually, wouldn't that actually wouldn't have happened in paper? Arena is a scam. Deck does feel very nice when you're doing stuff like this, though. Whale. <clears throat> yeah, give me my boat back, please. So we're drawing boat into glyph. That's fine. play paper very rarely man but i'm not i'm not got anything against it i would play it way more if it was more convenient <laughs> so if they kill this food the glyph will discover into another glyph huh Very interesting. Yeah, the glyph, the glyph is sick, man. It is. All of the new cards in this deck are sick. Except maybe, maybe the Sentinel? The Sentinel's really the only one that's even up for debate, and it, it seems like it's good so far. The, the bow, the glyph, um, the siren, these these are all insane cards. Larcenist is pretty good too. Sentinel seems pretty good so far.
mean, this is strong. It would have been even better if I didn't miss four damage. <laughs> <clears throat> Starting to look like our four damage was maybe a mistake to miss. Maybe. <clears throat> That's actually a sick draw, man. I can play I can play the siren, crew the boat with the siren, and then I've also I've still got enough mana to activate my land. One is a race lord, huh? Fourteen. We need to do fourteen. I feel like I can do fourteen, maybe. Race? Dude, I'm attacking, man. You better believe I'm attacking with my creatures. Good games. <laughs> That's just, that is a lot of fat creatures, chat. <laughs> that is a lot of creatures with four and five power. One sec, fair about. Hmm, okay, okay, okay. Kind of like a weird control deck here give me tracker royal treatment and spell pierce looks good It's always the cookies and the the archivists that look fucking trash, huh? You've made the crooks your net worth is on Google. My net worth. <clears throat> I don't know how that's possible. Pierce. <clears throat> yeah, man, my, my net worth's about twenty k gems. Yeah. Piercing uh, Virtue sounds good. <laughs> Are they playing Odger? Are they playing Odger with adventure creatures? When was the last time you played the paper? Yeah, I'm a, I mean, I'd rather not answer that. Thanks. 
This is called the bait tedacity. Get baited with on it. <laughs> oh my, they're like a cocker spaniel, honestly. <clears throat> nice removal. Like some pedigree chum to go alongside that. <clears throat> A water spaniel? A cock her spaniel. Vine stock. Vine stock plus ginger brute. What a combo. <clears throat> no land, Keck W. Well, opponents playing their own deck, right? You can, always, you can always rely on people playing their own deck to have not put in enough lands in their deck, so... That'll happen every time. Every fucking time. Go! Easy points. That's a quite a cool idea though. Does that does that blue god give you the creature when you rebound your That's very interesting. I mean the adventure cards are just so shit that it's not really worth it, but when you combine the shit adventure cards with your shit god, you've probably got a shit deck, but it's a cool idea. Definitely a cool idea. <clears throat> okay. Rare game where we actually draw a worm, right? If you Ammon Ket into a god and it dies, it transforms back into the Lazatip. What, back into the 4-4 creature and you get to choose again? I mean, that's nice too, huh? That is nice. Blue, black though. Blue, black. I guess you want the black one? Black one's pretty bad though. Glyph, not not against open mana, I don't think, no. The glyph is so so much damage, right? We don't want to we don't want to waste it. Okay, do not don't activate your ginger brute. Please block the ginger brute. Damn it. Good morning, Mr. Zoltan. Good morning. Good to see you. Good to see you. It's good to know we're on first name uh, first name basis. A 
lot of weird blue white creature decks we're playing against, man. Like weird Esper God deck, weird Esper mid range with bats. Now, now we're blue white Cathar Commando. <laughs> Looks like they're 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 playing some sort of flash shit, huh? Eric and Giada, maybe. for sentinel use the map on the flyer and click our ginger boot i guess set up for glyph next turn hopefully hopefully if it's a counter we can get it out here and if it's a <laughs> Emperor. It'd be good to get it out too, I suppose. For the glyph next turn. There's a counter, okay. I guess in this case we just attack, right? Just resolve your cookie and attack, man. We won a land? Untap land? Put the glyph on the mate and animate the food? Sounds like a good turn. Yeah, we're not, we've not really been able to go ham with the glyph yet in any of these matches because we keep playing against fucking low to the ground blue creature decks, huh? So, you do need to be a little careful. I guess, again, it's another blue, like, it's another holding up mana, man. We've got to just attack with the land here. There's no, no choice. Why? What do you mean why? I'm not casting spells into their fucking counters, man. When I attack with 5-5 five five or risk your available resources. <clears throat> I guess I'll attack with a 5-5 five five then. I mean, I'm, I'm really we're attacking with a 7-7, seven seven, huh? Emperor's a card? It is. And what use is a fucking glyph against an emperor? That's fine. One land for two cards. Tis a good deal.
They're so greedy, man. They are so greedy. <laughs> it's nuts. Bonus deck. Bonus deck is quite nice, but it's not very good against four fours, though. Four fours are strong against most decks, to be fair. Not wrong. Not incorrect. They can use the treasure from the Larsenist to cast their virtue, but they'll they'll die to that, right? Giving me back the cookie. <laughs> yeah, they just they just can't really use the virtue, man. You just can't really use it. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, we can finally resolve our shit chat. Isn't it better to use this on the cookie? <laughs> why not win the game? What do you mean, why not win the game? There was no lethal. I do plan on winning the game. Alright, flashy boy, huh? Flashy, flashy boy, boy. Flashy boy, flashy boy. Ginge, cauldron, tracker. Royal treatment. Spell pierce. Spell pierce. <laughs> Another gamer playing their own deck that doesn't have enough lands in their deck, by the way. A common theme. <laughs> hmm. Try one mate, one cauldron. Where are my boats? Where the hell are my boats? Uh, 
I get a ginger brute's a little worse, huh? It feels really bad to to activate ginger brute just to get past a token. Guess we'll keep one in. What a cool deck. Yeah, someone someone's playing this deck in the top 10, man. <laughs> Standard gamer in top 10. That's enough. I need to hear nothing more. Well, actually, I need to hear one more thing, and that's the date. But once I've heard the date and it's after the second week of the, of the month, <clears throat> I'll be trying the archetype, no problem. No problemo. All right, opponent, you wouldn't dare counter my boat. You wouldn't fucking dare. Toxic. <clears throat> Where's all the Cavern of Souls gamers to put these fuckers in their place? Okay, we're not surprised it's an Aaron and Giada deck. Nice taps. Well, I wouldn't be able to put the Audacity on the Siren anyway, right? Because of their fox. I guess we can do it this turn, though. Because that would let us uh, remove their Erin Giada. Mm -mm -mm. Nothing. Okay, that's fine. That's all fine. Semic aggro, bro. The deck slaps, man. <laughs> the deck slaps. <laughs> it's nice. <clears throat> Our creatures are just monsters, man. So strong. Virtue dealt with. Aaron and Giada dealt with. I like what I see so far. There's a boat. I also am a boat enjoyer. Alright, so they're gonna go Merex, make this appear, so we'll get to resolve our boat. That's fine. I 
I guess we're attacking with the sentinel, right? <clears throat> Attack with the sentinel, kill the mastermind to a double block, and that lets our larcenist start attacking. Get to make a map token anyway. And they block this siren. Now you're scared opponent, are you? Scared of death, are we, my friend? I would be too. Death looms. Virtue, okay. Looks fine. Cookie. 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 Cookie, 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 cookie. I see you. That is a strong land, man. That is a strong, strong land. Alright, I think I think we're okay just to wait for a sec. Get rid of this virtue. Try and uh try and pump these creatures up just a little bit more. For a better attack. Vanquish the horde. <clears throat> I mean that's fine. Okay. This is why we play boats, chat. Boat up, baby. Mm -mm -mm. Not a card I expected to see, but it's still fine. Cauldron. Hello? Auto tapper. Maybe maybe leave lethal available. Maybe leaving lethal available would be a good idea. <laughs> They're fine. Oh, we can call we can cauldron and steal the mastermind ability. That seems pretty sick. We can also steal the cookie ability. That seems potentially even more sick. Back in the land is good too, of course. It's, it's kind of gas, man. It's kind of gas.
opponent goes to one, we get our boat back. All right, they go to three, I suppose. Very nice, very nice. That was better. I still don't know how I feel about the... The Sentinels, man. Our three drop. Like, I mean, it's ob obviously okay. I don't, I don't know if it's much better than okay, though. Let's keep going. I'm not sure if it's the best thing we could possibly have in the deck. It's good. I don't know, man. It's a three drop, but it can't attack into Rafine or, or Shelly, man. It's a dicey. Extreme dice. What three drop can? Mm, breaches. Liliana. Um, Dino. Glissa. Simply sacrifice a creature to Obanexilus. That's a play too. Seraph? I mean, I guess Seraph can attack into Rafinha, yeah, but it's, uh... <clears throat> that, also, that card has its own problems. Let's see. I will say the Sentinel is nice as like an alternative play if they're holding up mana and you're a bit a bit scared of using your glyph, huh? There it is. Very cool. These audacities have been sick too, man. I'll get in for 10. I'll get in for 10, man. Minus 10. <clears throat> Good games. I doubt they were expecting to take 10 there. <clears throat> what did they do? They... Gained life and removed my flyer. I'm just dead. Pretty sick. Mm. I made the I made this version, but on only because I don't know what the real version is. <laughs> I mean, I'll, I'll pay the guy that made the real version five bucks if he'll show his face and give me it. I'll pay five five dollars for the deck list. <clears throat> I think it's from Asha. I think she just did the same thing I did, which is get told in chat that someone's popping off and then make make her own version. <clears throat> There's somebody in the top ten of the ladder playing this deck. I don't know if she knows the exact list or not, but <clears throat> I, I would assume that she just did the same thing as I'm doing. Hi, I am the creator. Yeah, I don't know if I can trust you, man. 
How many larcenists do you want against ramp? Like, it's a little spooky to only play two. Or sorry, it's a little spooky to play none, is what I mean. But two feels like a lot, though, at the same time. Because you kind of, you just want to remove one of their creatures, I suppose, huh? One angel, one attracts, uh, whatever. And then we want Haywire Might, and we want to take out... <laughs> Archivist and Sentinel. No no messing around here, we, we send. <laughs> you think you can play this in best of one? I don't see why not, man an aggressive deck right you can play aggressive decks in best of one last i last i heard anyway Be careful with your Thran portals though, Jesus. These Thran portals, they, they try and get you. They really do. <laughs> yep, there it goes again. Classic. Not this time, Bozo. Send in the worm! No, 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 no. Send in the brute. You have one blue source at the moment. Don't play your siren. Don't be an idiot. This is it's so much damage, man. It's kind of crazy. Alright, Ramp Lord slapped. That was good. <clears throat> that was good. <laughs> Absolutely slapped. Ecuador. Ecuador. <laughs>